the chief of staff of a Republican representative was forced to resign because of a dick pic. It wasn't one that he released, it was released against his will. It was unleashed on the world against his will by his former girlfriend, Jennifer Ruberez Alba. I believe we have a picture of her actually. Uh, you might recognize her, and if you do, you're a naughty, naughty boy because she is an adult actress, and that's why you recognize her. Um, but she had been involved with the chief of staff uh, by the name of Adam Kuhn. <laughs> eventually, <laughs> eventually, his staff just couldn't do it anymore, and they broke up, and she was not happy about it. Um, now, she eventually uh, sent a tweet out. She said, that, there's a direct message that she sent to a political reporter saying that she wanted to teach the pompous ass a lesson. Uh, and uh, she was trying to make him hate her. That's what she says. Now he, the, the chief of staff who was forced to resign, eventually put out a statement saying that over the weekend I was the victim of an attack on Twitter from a woman I had a relationship with in my personal life. I realized and apologized I had used poor judgment in my personal life regarding this relationship. The woman who posted this has reached out to me to apologize. Well, yeah. ain't that nice of her. Yeah. This is, I, I, feel, I actually feel bad for this guy. I don't yeah, care about his political affiliation. I think what she did was so classless and so lame, and mm -hmm. I would feel the same way like if a guy did that to a woman. Like, how pathetic are you? Really, you're that hurt over your stupid relationship that you're going to release his penis picture? And then I hate that he was forced to resign. Why? He was in a relationship with her. I'm pretty sure they had sex at some point. I'm yeah. pretty sure that he has a penis, she has a vagina. There's nothing wrong with that. I hate this kind of stuff. It drives me yeah. absolutely insane. The only justification for firing him is that they're the uh, family values party, and no, he was, you're right, he was not married, he was single, yeah. but she was married. Yes. She was married and a former porn star. That goes against their perceived uh, family now values. How did they know that it was his penis that she tweeted, right? Yeah, but I would have it, denied it. Wrote it wrote chief of staff on it. <laughs> Back when Anthony Weiner was having all of his political troubles, I frequently came on the air and said that I don't care what he's tweeting to anyone. That's between him, his mistress, his other mistresses, and his wife. If she wants to divorce him, feel free, but that has nothing to do with his political career. And we were not just saying that because he was a Democrat, even if a media mediocre one, we also believe when it comes to the, the GOP, the same thing. That's your personal life, that's your sexual life. We're libs, not just on the surface. We actually believe that you should be able to express yourself however you want, even if that comes in the form of a dick pic.